what is going on? Oh, that hurt. I've been under the weather for quite a while. Luckily, I'm bouncing back. It's a nice uh, 20 degrees outside. Thought I'd go for a little ride-z. Give you guys some food for thought. Hopefully keep this pretty quick and short. Why is it that we undervalue one another when we exist? And we almost overvalue one another when we pass away. Uh, during my sick period, uh, the anniversary of my father's passing came around, so I had a lot of time to contemplate this. And I've always wondered for a long time in life, why is it that when, when we're alive, we don't appreciate each other in the ways that we should, and then when someone passes away, then we, we have this realization of how great they were and how much we miss them and how we wish we would have spent more time with them, when the reality of it is we could have spent more time with them, uh, we could have told them the things that we want to tell them, uh, we should have been honoring them in the moment when they existed, such as if somebody's a great person or they have a good personality or they uh, they inspire you or they really do something to help you you should be telling them on a, on a routine basis constantly you shouldn't wait until that person's gone to, to jump on this bandwagon of oh goodness they're gone and I, I miss them and they mean something to me you know you should have you should have said that when they were here because now they can't hear you and now it doesn't matter it doesn't it it, it it matters but it doesn't matter in the sense that they're not here to really appreciate that now and I bet that would have meant a lot to them when they were here so one of the things that I want you guys to think about is how are you honestly appreciating valuing the people in your lives in present you know, I'll use myself for an example. A lot of you guys out there, guys and gals, you know, I'm a content creator, so you come around and I make a video and you, you, you take time out of your day to post a comment saying how you liked it or whatever. Yet if I was to disappear, which I did for about a month or so, where were all you guys? You know, where were, where were the emails or the, the messages or the text messages or phone calls or anything like that saying, Hey, haven't seen you in a while. I really appreciate you. Hope you're okay. Where was that kind of stuff? And that's kind of my case in point. And I'm not saying that anybody out there is guilty of this, and I don't blame any of you because I, I know how busy all of our lives are, and honestly, I'm guilty of doing the same exact things. But here's the thing. If you really appreciate somebody and value them, you need to show them that. You need to prove that. Otherwise, you're just tossing around these meaningless statements. So what I'm getting at, guys, is appreciate people now while they're alive. Don't wait till they're dead to jump on some bandwagon to throw out these statements uh, like how great they were and how much you, you like them and you wish you would have gotten to know them or blah, 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 whatever. Don't wait till they're gone to say those things. Say them to them now. And invest more time in the people that you truly appreciate. Invest time in them. For example, with myself, you know, I'm very, very, very cautious with people because of that simple fact that I know that I can disappear and I can have hundreds of people saying I mean something to them, I disappear and nobody gives a fuck. So I'm very cautious to who I invest my time into. I'm not saying you can't have like a favorite person that you love and you enjoy them and stuff, but if you really love and enjoy them, you know, in the ways that you say you do, then just go out of your way to invest more time into showing them that. Don't wait till they're gone, because honestly, at that point, it's meaningless. It's just your self-guilt and pity. And lastly, remembering people, right? This is the last thing. Don't just create memorials and honor them and immortalize them in one moment in time. Immortalize them in eternity. And by that, I mean keep them alive in your memories and remember them. That's why we have the term remembrance. It's not something like a memorial ride where you go out and you ride for them for one day to honor their memory and then fucking forget about them. You go out on that day, you ride for them, and you remember
remember them every single fucking day of your life. That's what you do. That's the that's the right way to do it. So again, food for thought, guys. Welcome to 2016. 